In this video, we will see how to edit and open a WebI document. You can edit an existing WebI document using web interface or via WebI rich client. You can also see the list of recent documents that are open in WebI tool. The extension of a WebI document is .wid. To open an existing document, you have to navigate to file tab at the top and click open. Let us go to the SAP system and see how to edit and open existing documents. Let's see how you can open and edit the existing report in the repository. So first of all, we will go to the BI Launchpad and here we will enter the credentials to log into the system. So once we will log in, after that we have to go to the document which we want to open and edit. So let's say if I go here and after that if I traverse to the report which I want to edit. So if I go to the folders here, if I expand the public folders and here if I go to the folder in which my report reside. So I will right click the report and then I can click on modify if I want to have all the functionalities like the data provider all the other functionalities available so i have to click in the modify mode but if i just want to uh, change the report design and i don't want to touch the data provider part i can use the view mode and then i can go to the design so let's say if i click on this view and after that if i click on the design mode so if i go to the design mode so now i can do the changes in this report. So let's say if I want to remove this profit column from my report. I can simply select it. I can delete it. And after that I can save that back to the repository. So this is a very normal scenario in the projects where we have to edit the existing report. So how you will edit the existing report. So you have to just go to the launch pad or your will be rich client. After that, you have to open that report and then you have to do the changes and once the changes are done, you can save this report using this option of save. So once you will click on save, the report will be saved in the BO repository. So now if you will close it and if you will reopen it after the refresh, so you will see that the changes will be reflected. If I click on the view now, I can see that now the profit column is removed from my report. So this is how you can open the existing report and you can edit the report. You can do the changes and then how you can save it back to the server. Thank you.